So, does everyone remember their own names? Hi, my name is Zeke. Hi, I'm, I'm, I'm Doom. I'm, I'm still Doom. It's still Doom. I haven't been, yeah, Mom I haven't Doom. been beaten in the head too hard yet. Doom Kun was we almost the last escaped video, from the basement. But no one watched that video. That's fine. Hey, the creator of Seven Stand User hope. watched that video. Well, yeah, actually, you're all secretly introduced in the Seven Stand User video. If you pay attention, you're the save files. Yes, I, I did know that. And it's me, Lo. Hello. We're doing another guessing video because I'm shameless. Hey, Lo. Ha <laughs> ha. So. And, and, well, I'm hoopstick this one. Yeah, I'm not. I guess I should introduce it. So if this completely falls off the rails, it's not my fault, even though it's I'm his fault. leader. No, it's your fault. Yep. It's your fault that no, we had this I'll idea take all the first the place. I'm the Genshin Impact player here, and it's honestly, it's it's my sins that have allowed this situation to happen in the first place. Oh, God. And that's what we're doing. Uh-huh. We're gonna guess. Well, no, I'm Another gonna guess. Another gotcha I'm gonna guess game. I'd play this piece of shit. I'd play, I'd play a piece of Chinese spyware called Genshin Impact almost every day. So when there's not an event going on, but pretty regularly, for probably too much. Certainly too much. I play Genshin, but uh, these these two bozos, you know, with their productive lifestyles, they don't know much about the game. So yeah, because we're I, here to do. I, I legitimately is... did not want Chinese spyware on my computer. <laughs> I am of the same mindset. I did not want the Chinese spyware. Also, gacha games are a waste of money. I mean, yeah, well, they're a waste of not just your money, but your time. Mm -hmm. And your privacy. Which is more valuable than any amount of money. They'll just, just they'll waste everything. They'll, they'll take it all, man. They'll take it all. And, you know, because they're uh, healthy human beings, they don't play this game. So, uh, it, it, I'm, I'm, I'm here to make sure it stays that way. I'm going to test to them. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give them descriptions of Genshin Impact characters. I'm gonna give them three characters to choose, and they're gonna guess which character matches that description. I, it's my job here to make sure that their affinity for Genshin stays as low as possible, <laughs> so they don't get uh, sucked into gacha hell. It's actually oh, don't even worry, if you play Doom. the game, you gotta agree that that's a bad outcome. It's a bad. No, ending. don't worry. I I can feel my enthusiasm draining. It's actually the same as... exact scenario as the Fate video, where it's like if you get any points at all. Something's bad. It's Oops. it's even worse. At least if you, at least you're giving your money to Nasu, who's gonna fund the actual fucking uh, Melty Blood remake and actually remake Sukihime. He's you, you, <laughs> that dirty gambling September. money is actually paying off for something meaningful. Yeah, we'll actually get a fighting game out of that one. Teacher Doom Kun Sensei, Doom Sensei. Yes. Uh, what's a Genshin, and why are um, they so impactful? We don't know yet. I theorize that at the end of the first story arc, which should be about six years from now, we'll learn what the Genshin actually is. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Sensei, I have another question. You. Yeah. Why is the Genshin Impact? Um, you know, people who play this developer's other game, Honkai Impact 3rd, I believe it's called, uh -huh. Um, have lots and lots of, like, Hyperborea-ass crazy conspiracy theory lore that they would love to share with you about the Impacts and the Honkais and the Genshins and what it all means and how the Genshin Impact world is actually, like, an alternate reality of the Honkai Impact world, but it's stuck in the medieval times because gods want to prevent, uh the world from progressing because it's like Gurren Lagann and if they progress too much they'll get fucking deleted from space time. President Pooh? Wow. That was so a little more in-depth than I was actually expecting for a shit post. <laughs> that sounds like, There's that just sounds like the CCP, I'm sorry. <laughs> as soon as you start getting too much money, you gotta go bye-bye. Wow, so the CCP is the uh, anti-spirals. I mean, <laughs> actually... <laughs> 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 it's just have Winnie the Pooh have, just have, enough. have Winnie the Pooh have that little spit coming out of his mouth. <laughs> Anyhow, all right, I think it's time to start. Okay, let's start. Yeah. Who that character from Genshin Impact? Who this? A straightforward person who is so the only outrider of the Knights of Favonius. Their amazing mastery of the glider has made them a three-time winner of the Gliding Championship in Mondstadt. As a rising star within the Knights of Pavonius, they are always ready for any challenging tasks. Your choices are A. Amber B. Bennett 
C. Venti. Okay, so you said like 15 words that should have all been like highlighted in the subtitles and had like translator notes. So you can mouse over them and then get yes. the paragraph long description. <laughs> what is an Outrider? What is the, What are the Knights of Pavonius? What is the, the gliding championship in Mondstadt? Mondstadt is its own thing. Okay, so Mondstadt is medieval Germany. The Knights of Favonius are anime night horror bullshit. You know how it is. You know what that is. You can, you can intuit. You can, come on, it's this. There's nothing in the world of Genshin Impact is original. You can intuit a lot of this stuff. They okay, but what is a gliding thing. championship? Okay, so you know how you can glide in the game, like, like no, kind of I don't. With Breath of the Wild. So this game is Breath of the Wild, right? But with more numbers. Oh. So you can glide in it like in Breath of the Wild, and uh, in Great. canon, the characters glide around off of things. See, why? This character why is the best you... at gliding. On Hold things. on, that doesn't make any fucking sense. That okay, that inherently makes no sense. Gliding in Breath of the Wild happens because Link just picked up a, like a tiny piece of parchment, and he's in a post-apocalypse. And <laughs> so, why are these like in, this entire fantasy Magitech society? They're all moving at piece of parchment paper speeds on their gliders. That doesn't make any f Are they all stupid? Yes. Well, th two things, young fort. Uh, one, they don't pick up pieces of paper like Link does and then fly all over the world with them. Uh, they sprout wings out of their back. Why do they okay. fly as fast as a guy that picked up a piece of paper? They have They're wings! They actual wings. It's, it's, it's like, it's a, it's a prosthetic. It's, it's a tool? That doesn't it's... matter, it's still a wing! And so they spark wings out of their back, right? Okay. Two. Um... You, know, <laughs> you I, had I, no I two! <laughs> One, it. they're wings. Two, um... They're wings! Okay, I, I'm i going to, to go on a wild mass guess here, and I'm just going to say that it's A for Amber. See, here's what's the your, problem. What's your, what's your guess for? Here's the problem. Like, I've I've seen my my favorite streamers sell their soul to China and play uh, Genshin for a second, and I know Amber just screams at you, and I know Venti is a character that people are like, oh man, I want to roll Venti. I've never heard of Bennett in my entire life. So I think A and C are pretty much real characters, but I don't know. I know that C, they have memes of them, like him being silly and epic, so I'm gonna assume it's A because there's no no one, like not even Genshin Impact player probably knows B, so I'm gonna assume A as well. Cause C, he seems like he has a personality, so I'm gonna go with A. I'm gonna let you hold that. I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let you, you keep that because Outrage uh, brings in engagement. So I'm gonna keep and that's that. why they don't even care. B about Amber. looks like he's B looks like he's a fucking Xenoblade. He's a fucking loser. Who cares? It's true. Dirt. He looks like he looks like he's like he's tucking the Rex. He's like, <laughs> hey, hey, Rex, buddy, I got your ship up and running. Goodbye. You'll never see me again because I'm fucking dead because my village blowed up. Now you feel sad about me being dead. I want to correct you, but that is actually how I think they sound sometimes. <laughs> Xenoblade 2 is fucking atrocious, dude. The English dub. Some of it is a little. Um, it's. Uh, Mitra, why are you blushing? Shut up! Questionable. It's not. It's not consistent. I will not. I will not say every vocal performance is bad. Obviously, but there, there is no quality control in that dub. I can verify that much, having played about eighty percent of the game. Are ready okay. for the answer? Mm. I think so. We both guessed A. So if we're both wrong, we're both not degenerates. Damn it, we're degenerates. Sorry, sorry, we're, we're, we're off on the wrong foot. You got it correct. I mean, she had dog hairs on her design. So, so what? Uh, oh yeah, so did they, they were on her head, and it was like super cute. And then they put them down there, and now she never wears them. <laughs> it's, 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 it's honestly biggest downgrade since launch. Throw character design into garbage. Don't inform people by looking at the character. Yeah. I course. mean, she still has goggles, at least. I mean, she mentions that she's the gliding champion of Mondstadt uh, every, like, 15 minutes or some shit, so... Get ready for the gliding champion of Mondstadt! So this... I, that took longer than I thought, only because I, I, I underestimated how little you guys could include with uh, the anime bullshit of this game's story setting. Oh no no, we're so, done with that. We're we've just trying to fill up their time. There's more. No no, don't don't you don't you get don't you get smart with me, young Z. Oh dear. 
Roberta, you're gonna learn Chinese by the end of this bit, my oh. man. Oh <laughs> man! Wait, wait, wait hold on. Is our social credit score improving with each correct answer? <laughs> oh, that depends. <laughs> That depends. Do we then approve of the CCP after we say we got the question correct? <laughs> I can't wait to ride on a real train. <laughs> Eat real food <laughs> and be allowed to use social media. Yeah, I can't wait so that they let me get out of my city so that I don't die. They won't strap me to it's that just... metal chair. Who this? An astrologist of great skill and equally great pride. This character has taken up residence in Mondstadt to avoid incurring the wrath of their master after unwittingly reading the latter's diary. Your choices are A. Amy, B. Kaya, and C. Mona. A and C are just the same character with a different hair color. So I'm going with B. D d you might be saying that again, my man. This game only has five body types in it. And they got old pretty quick. Oh, in yeah, it's explicitly, yeah, I think we were talking about Fate Grand Order, and then it's like we're talking about, I think the discussion was about, like, it, it like, had somehow ended up a, oh, man, look at Raiko's ridiculous orb tittos, and then it was just like, oh, it, that's it nice, wasn't actually that, Genshin Impact doesn't point. have those, I was like, what? And then you showed me, like, four models of an ass, and here are the only, and you told me that these are the only asses in Genshin Impact, because they, they're just reskinning <laughs> these four models. Yeah, because because the, you know because of the, the open world bullshit, like it te like making a new like body type for a character is like a, a development commitment. So generally speaking, we're just gonna keep getting characters that fit the adult male, young male, adult female, uh, young female, and little baby girl uh, body type until the end of time, or people actually start getting sick of it. But, uh, yeah, it actually wasn't about Raikou's Tittos. It was about, um, you showed me some, like, big, like, some huge-ass, badass motherfucker. Oh, right, and yeah. And I was like, yeah. But I showed you King Hassan. Was... He's, like, a mega death knight. He's, like, eight feet tall. Yeah, like, big-ass, like, skeleton-ass dude or something like yeah. that, maybe? But, yeah, totally. Like, uh, and I was like, oh, yeah, Genshin couldn't have that. It's physically impossible yeah. to have a nice day in Genshin Impact. <laughs> We can't. We don't even have like buff dudes yet. We don't even have dudes who look like they could like, punch something. <laughs> dudes hard. that could look like they could start a revolution. <laughs> that's. I guess. Yeah, I think that's that on purpose. Punch boulders. <laughs> these these guys are too effeminate to ever start any kind of cultural <laughs> like upbringing. Yeah, yeah no this, real I, ass men in Genshin yet. That is actually too true of being a psyop for the CCP. Yes. Mm. Yes. Become weak. Oh. <laughs> yes, become the system. What are you building boy. up all that muscle for? <laughs> oh shit, okay, I uh, forgot we were doing this. Um, yeah, eight. I, I yes. vote B. You vote B. It's okay, this is content. I only got 11 of these, so. <laughs> because like I'm I guessing said, that Mondstadt eight's here is just, the country. They're wearing the same fucking outfit. They might as well be from, like, the same fucking cult. I think B is a decent, like, curveball because, like, this is a vaguely interesting backstory, and I don't think they would give that to a dude. Like, it has to be A or C, but they're the same fucking character. I'm gonna just assume it's C. I'm assuming it's C because I feel like she has the biggest glow up out of all of them. Oh, see, I'm assuming it's B because I'm racist and he has a different skin tone. Hmm. <laughs> the wrath of the, the, wrath of the <laughs> master is it because of his race. <laughs> no, he had to take up resident in Mondstadt. I'm assuming he's from a different country. He, 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 he read the master's diary and he wasn't supposed to be inside the house. Listen. You know, he read listen. the master's diary and did not like the racist thoughts that were <laughs> inscribed inside. Hey, wait we were a second. talking about Mondstadt, and he said it's supposed to be medieval Germany. And well, the Germans didn't have dark skin, so. I mean, they also didn't have like like pantyhose and like like thigh high stockings and tito windows. They also don't sprout wings from their back. What do you want from me? They also didn't have magic powers, to be fair. Yes, they did. <laughs> had magic powers, now did they? Back in medieval Germany. You, yeah, still, um, you still had to why roll do you think with we had gems, the Spanish though, Inquisition. for some reason. <laughs> it was a gotcha-based medieval society. That's why it didn't. That's why it was like stuck technologically for so long. All right, All right can I move on it? to the next B slide? B or C? Here we go. All right, Zeke says B. Uh, Fort says C. Fort is correct. Wow. 
You're more of a degenerate than I am. Oh my god. I figured that uh, we could go over like, why you, you picked the choices you did, but you, you pretty much laid it out just as you thought. I also you have the fanciest design. I also feel like I saw C in a porn once. So I was like, oh, See, that's probably it. Not a lot of Genshin Impact porn. Not a, and a lot of it is Mona. So she's one of the characters. Yeah, they and like it's like, because... I'm just like, really? This is the best you got to offer? Really? Because she she has she she has a butt, and if, if someone like zoomed in on the character models and found that her butt is slightly larger than the other butts. Oh yeah, you, you for the people who yeah, share but, the body. Yeah, but just there. like but like with Fate, it's just like they're shoving that ass on the screen every second. Well, you can't Fate has that diverse ass. and amazing character designs, so of course uh, that, that which, should inspire as an artist. Which what do we have in Genshin? Mm -hmm. Sorry, slightly yeah, bigger no. ass. Which, which game was it that uh, tried to have bunny girls in the global server and China threw a hissy fit and so they turned uh, that away? That was Hankai Impact, and they weren't even in the game. They were like part of a promotional video or something. Wait, and then, what's up with uh, bunny girls? Uh, according uh, to some psychopaths raised they by the CCP, the sensibilities of the Chinese people. Well, I know yes, that, they, but because why? Because they, they they have a connotation of being related to like strippers and whores and shit. Uh, because China hates beautiful women. Um, oh, right, because... they don't, China doesn't want you reproducing too much, I guess. Exactly. Well, now you're getting it's, it. it. It's a byproduct of that, and also, you know, gotcha games. Um, listen, listen, like, listen, just because we have a three-child policy now. people into their player base and fan bases, so it's, it, it is what it is. It is what it is. We're off to a great start. I'm sure Genshin Get this pantyhose bitch happy. off my screen. <laughs> Genshin fans are loving it. Who it is? Captain of the crew. The crew, not the crew, the crew, with quite the reputation in Liyue, which is, uh, I have to stop to give you guys the dictionary in a couple seconds. This is China. China. Liyue is China, okay? Ancient ass, like Wukong times, China. There are those who say they can split mountains and part the sea. Others say they draw lightning through their sword. Gee, Some I wonder who they... it could be. <laughs> Some say that even the mightiest of sea beasts are no match for them. For those not from Liyue, it may sound like a party joke, but those who that have sailed with this character will say, no matter what the sea beasts there may be, that person be sure to split them all in two. I'm gonna make you guys share the reading load for some of these, by the way. Okay. <laughs> oh, you're gonna have one of us read one of these? Okay. Uh, Eventually. So, A's a fucking loser. He's just a twink. He's nobody. Uh, well, he was from the last question. It's too. the it's only wrong. adult male body type they have. Yeah, what but you... true. Yeah, but this twink, <laughs> the, like the twink on the right, he has like beautiful hair. Twink A, he seems like he'd be a sub. Like, like yeah, in the fucking Yaoi Dojins, like Diluc is like pounding Kaya's ass and he's crying. That seems canonical. So it can't be A. Cause that sounds cool. <laughs> You, I would you, laugh you, if it's the other way around. You're repeatedly saying that, like, this in the description that, like, splitting things in two, and B has a huge ass sword and an eye patch and is a pirate. So it's pretty. Also, pretty Chinese heavily, design. Yeah, pretty clearly the strongest. Like, the only reason that it wouldn't be B if it's a misdirect and it's the look, the pretty boy, that I, I think I heard girls get horny, horny over once. Do you think I should be risky or. or try to be out there or go safe with B. Oh, don't ask me that question. Okay. I I don't even know which way I want to go. Believe in the heart of the cards. But the heart of the cards is just cheating. Literally, did you know that the Millennium Puzzle Cheat. will just manipulate his deck to whatever card he needs will be the next one he draws? Of course. Well, he's not cheating, he's just... He's guiding his own fate. <laughs> that's literally, <laughs> that's literally the bullshit twist. He's he's controlling his own fate. He's stacking his own fucking deck. Anyway, uh, yeah. I'll, I'll, B I'll. has the cheap pow thing going on. So, and since uh, Liu Yue is China, yeah, that's a good point. The, yeah, that, that's that's the big thing. And then their sword. And I okay, only okay, see I, one of them. You're right, you're right. It has to be B. I know, I'm know. i going to double down on B. You know why? Wait, I'll, I'll, why? are you going to say B? I was going to say B. Okay, so the reason why it can't be A or C is because this isn't a sad, tragic backstory about how, like, they had a brother or sister or a loved one or, like, a, their father beat them. Like, a sad, tragic thing to make you go sad cry. And that that's, manda mother. that's mandated for boys. This has no tragedy in it, so I have to assume mm. it's B. Tiger Festival. Yeah, I'm going with B. 
Alright, here we go. Yeah. Correct. <laughs> this is this is not going well. You guys are you're pretty, pretty perceptive. There we go. Next up. An apprentice and herb gatherer. Wait, for are the you gonna have one of us read these? Oh yeah, that's right. Well, I was gonna save it until it was funny, but you know what? Yeah, go ahead. You can you can read this one for it. Okay. An apprentice and herb gatherer at Boo Boo Pharmacy. Blessed by the Adepti with a body that cannot die, this character cannot do anything without first giving themselves orders to do it. Their memory is like a sieve. Out of necessity, they always carry around a notebook in which they write anything important that they are sure to forget later. But on their worst days, they even forget to look at their notebook. Round one! Uh... And your options are A. Rosaria B. Chow. C. Chi Chi. I'm going What's C. Gonna I'm going C. She's got the undead talisman on her forehead. She also looks helpless. Also looks helpless. Yeah, I'm going C. Man, see, this is this. Is, I did my best. I did my best, you know, because this game doesn't have as many characters in it as you would think, because they take five fucking million years to make. That's fine. And so we only get one every now and then. Also, the game's not that long. I'm relatively speaking. I guess there's well, actually a lot given how long it's been out, but whatever. Eh, but it's been in development for a while. As the wealthiest individual oh. in Mondstadt. Oh. Okay. This ever dapper character always presents themselves as the epitome of perfection. But behind the courteous visage burns a zealous soul that has sworn to protect Mondstadt at all costs, allowing them to mercilessly vanquish all who threatens their city. It's Diluc. See, I'm not sure. Diluc looks like a Kudere. Uh, ever dapper. <laughs> Otherwise, it's uh, Zhongli. Yeah, I think Deluc is like, to me, screens a lot more Kudere. This is a little more, like, see, I can see, like, the underlying passion more. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, but I think there's the courteous visage, and I think that he's got uh, the Mamoru stuck deep inside him. Yeah, I think it's a coin flip either way. I'll just be different and go see. Okay. So we have A and C? Yeah. I didn't uh, do a good job. Yeah. I haven't now we're tied. Once. So yeah, um, Diluc uh, looks like a, a scrawny little baby uh, because we don't have any cool ass male even body in his, types in the game yet. Even in this cool fire pose, he doesn't look passionate. They they call him the the I think it's like the the, the dark hero of Mondstadt uh, because he does Batman shit and he goes around at night and looks for for near ne'er ne ne do wells and monsters and shit beat up who are threatening the city. Like people with skin that's too dark. <laughs> I'm looking at you, Zayek. Kayak, or whatever the fuck your name was. <laughs> Kayak? <laughs> Gonna fucking flip him over and ride him all the way down the river? Is that what we're doing? I mean, yeah. This is Genshin. Oh. I, I, I could have something to say about that, but no, I'm, I'm leaving it for the, co the comments. So I'm, I'm driving engagement. You have no idea how much I'm helping you right now for it. I am, I am saving your career. Is it helping us, really? I just you feel like people me. have started to actively click off the video. I mean, we're not doing great. You guys are, are pretty in tune with Genshin Impact so far. And it's, it's, you told it's us that nothing is ever unique or anything like that. So right. your curveballs have not been curveballs. Right. Uh, man, what am I thinking? Yeah, you're right. I, I, try, I try, it's like, maybe it's a curveball. It's like, no, this sounds, yeah, generically... Like pretty boy, Gus up the look here. Yeah, I, I should yeah, be should less creative. Yes, that's right. <laughs> I, all of these picks have been like the least creative things ever. So, you see, Lo, I'm, I'm, I just caught up to you because I mastered the art of turning my brain off. I am officially too far gone in the day. I just don't need to think anymore. Zen state. Yeah, fans are loving. It. That's the exact state you need to this. also uh, be willing to roll this much for this. Pretty shit. much. As your soul leaves your body, uh, I'll read this one. There, there's one, there's a, 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 one entry in particular that I want. I think I'll make Fort read it because Zeke seems like he, he kind of, he, he can, he can, he can sort of handle this Chinese lingo. So I'm gonna make Fort do it and see what he comes up with. But I'll read this one. An alchemist with an insatiable curiosity towards the world and everything in it, attached to the Knights of the Vonies as an assistant to Albedo, their area focuses. Bio alchemy. 
They strive to enrich the world by transforming living things with the power of alchemy. Granted, the products of their research sometimes prove to be more weird than wonderful. But on the whole, they have made monumental contributions to the field of bioalchemy. First of all, I think we all just need to sit back and acknowledge Albedo is supposed to be Albedo. As we all know, all bad, all dead. You know what I'm saying? It's clearly Alfredo oh, cheese, about... you idiot. What, what the fuck did Zeke just reference? I don't understand. What, what, is, he what is he talking about? What is he referencing? You know, what is he saying? Grand Wizard Who's Waka. this guy thinking he is? Oh my god. Yeah, I didn't know yeah, you were a dirty Albed. Didn't know you were a dirty Albed. We're referencing the great, the, the great, <laughs> the great, the great, the great hero, the, 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 the great ginger supremacist Swaka from FF10. What the? Oh, fucking that dude! Yeah, dude, I barely remember anything from FF10. His first line is like, "Hey, he's Albed. Don't trust him." Don't trust our bed anymore, okay? Yeah, he's like, hey, welcome to my soccer gang, but also stay away from those our beds, eh? <laughs> we, we play bits ball, we have fun, but no, 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 our bed. No, our bed. <laughs> because I'm our bed. This is great. I can't believe I've been traveling with an our bed, a heathen. You're wrong. We have nothing against. Ha! No, but they just cause problems. I don't know why I'm doing this accent. Pick who you want to offend. Commit, cowards. That's John DiMaggio, isn't I, it? Listen, I can't, I can't commit to that. I need to offend the most amount of people possible. That's John DiMaggio, right? <laughs> the guy that does Maka? Yeah, English dub. That I think Jake so. the dog. Yeah. It's it's so funny that like his most racist role was in a Final Fantasy game. That's pretty cool, actually. It's it's pretty all right. Final Fantasy could be more racist. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's okay. We've already established that D&D is racist. As we all know, clearly, clearly... Because orcs are black people, right? I was gonna say halflings are Asians, but alright. Yeah, totally. I mean, I, I look at a halfling and I'm like, yeah, dude, Chinese people look just like that. That's so offensive. Yeah, they're so short, they can't dunk. I also look at an orc. They talk that. funny. I also look at an orc and go, They're wow, I can't believe that's a black person when black people are a thing in D&D. Yeah. I think that's my favorite part of that argument, that they're like, but it's clearly black people, as if there's yeah. no other worlds or no other countries in the Forgotten Realms. Well, I mean, just look at it, you know, crooked teeth, you know, uh, not paying child support, uh, violent. Green. Pathologically so, just greedy. You're, you're describing hillbilly rednecks. No, it's black people. It's so offensive. Right. Don't you see it? I... I it's have to terrible. admit I gouged my eyes out a little while ago because we were doing this. Oh, right. <laughs> we were guessing something, weren't we? Yeah. So, uh, who's the alchemist? Who's the bio-alchemist? It's, it's sucrose. Her name is literally a chemical. Her name is and literally she has a glasses. sugar. Also, she has glasses and she's holding a potion. Also, it's, sure? it's very funny that uh, the A is a, is a lolly with a drink. That's funny. <laughs> That's because she's aged in cat years. I, th I think it's just because she's just illegally underage drinking. Uh oh. Well, there go the brain cells. She's not going to come back up again, so I can tell you. Um, yeah, she, she's, she doesn't drink underage, but she does work in a bar at Mixed Drinks. I don't know why that's okay, but... Yeah. I mean, she even hates alcohol. Her dad's an alcoholic. Oh, she's Bart Simpson in that one episode where he made drinks for the mob. <laughs> uh, she hates her uh, drunker dad. So I mean, it's, it's Bart Simpson parallels. Why you little? Anyway, I'm gonna go to the next slide. I hate this. Wow. It's not funny anymore. If you're listening to this, if you're watching this, listening to it, whatever you're doing, it, it's not good anymore. I, I, I went into this confident. I thought I could throw you off the trail in some of these. The Genshin Impact's characters are just too straightforward and generic. Don't we have I, I, six maybe more? I shouldn't have, maybe I shouldn't have used fan art. Maybe I shouldn't have used the the official like descriptions from the website and wiki. I, should, I, I went wrong somewhere. Okay, so I'll give the Genshin Impact... You have to know that I tried. I'll give the Genshin Impact fans a, a, a little bone here. Maybe it's more interesting in story. <laughs> Sorry. What story? That's just reflexive. Never mind. You, I'm taking this bone back. You don't deserve it, Genshin Impact fans. 
<laughs> you might sell it for gotcha money, you pieces of shit. <laughs> <laughs> we need to have an intervention. Look, I, it, it'll be interesting in like a, a couple of uh, years, maybe like a decade, when the story is complete. You know, you know, like Finger in Order, like finish like their main story in like two years, right? <laughs> It's really so, uh, adorable that he thinks that the story is going to conclude. And so, like, so when the game launched, uh, they put out this preview video. It's like, it sort of like, like teases out each location you'll be visiting and the story that takes place. Then each chapter of the story is a new like content or whatever, right? And right now uh, we have Monstat and Liyue. The game launched with those. And in the next major patch, I think, we're getting the next continent. And between nine months and a year, we'll be getting the next, like, big major chapter update. And they outline, like, six or seven or eight of those those chapters in that previous video when the game launched. So that's where we're at. You know, in, That's the speed we're rolling at. You know, in, in Fate Grand Order, in two years, they finished their main story. And then they had, like, multiple sequels, basically, in terms of story content. And then sometimes their events are, they write the story is too good, and then they're like, oh shit, the story is too good. And now we have to make this like, like one week event and a permanent part of now the story. And now you can play it forever because the story was really good. And this was just an event and it was like a fully Damn, story. FGO sounds pretty good. No, but... But F FGO, on the other hand, doesn't have to model an entire continent when they want to release new content. TRUE! Maybe they shouldn't have done that. Maybe they it shouldn't have it... made their game completely dependent on a triple A title map for every chapter. Look at all this chapter. funny from people with low standards, like me. Just make like, a city or like base. a tiny island. I need for you're reading this. Oh, I see like, why you want me to read it. this shit. Yep. <laughs> Do your best. Okay. The Yu Hang of the Liyu Geishin. This character has much to say about Rex Lapis's unilateral approach to policy making Liyu but in truth, gods admire skeptics such as them quite a lot. They firmly believe that humanity's future should be determined by humans themselves, and that humans can even do better for themselves than the Archons and Adepti have. In order to prove this, they work harder than anyone else. I'm I'm guessing it's the end user license agreement, because nobody's made that joke before. Nope. This is nope. this You're is the first one. This is holy so, shit, Zeke. This is Thank so you. God. Did you guys hear Thank you. This I is know like, my genius knows no bounds. Okay, so this is like so bland and boring, I don't even know what to think. This could apply to like anything. Well, what's the blandest this... thing you could think of? An end user license agreement? This could like apply mm -hmm. to a secretary in like a Japanese office. Uh, this person basically, they, they hate God and they, they think gods are bitches and they should leave. Oh, they the see. He, he, he has fucking red highlights in his hair. Oh, <laughs> that's an edgy boy. Behind me? Nothing personal, kid. So do we have B and C? I, uh, sure. Alright, here we go. Read your terms of service. Yo, get your fans! I did it! I did it! I proved I got them! I got them once! There's hope! There's a chance! They you know what might the sad not part fall is? in! I went for the end user license agreement as a meme. My actual first thought was kitching. Yeah, but that's not what you So it's a fucking lie, Zeke, isn't it? Uh, well, hey. I, also, I was I was I should have gone with that cuz a I said it yeah. was like the most bland thing I've ever seen so it yes, should have been a I don't Lo, even know what this character's deal is Lo, you, I, you, I, like cuz like that's a thing that description had no specific personality I work hard what No don't don't think about it just They they feel. dislike god and they they work hard they're basically so like all, all those all those like chinese words that we saw before which is basically like uh, an elite officer of the ancient chinese military police at well, age can't whatever be. this is yeah, because I think I was reading too much into the defiance aspect. That wasn't a specific aspect of their personality. Because it was just that they work hard. That was it. As for um, what this character's deal is, I'm not even really sure. I'm not sure we know that much about her. 
you know, she shows up in the main story, but she she doesn't. She really looks do like she would be a. Impact. She looks like she could be in Grand Blue, like as a three star. She, well, let's just say she didn't leave a huge Genshin impact on me. Ha <laughs> God damn. This, uh, I need you to edit on some of my sunglasses to my avatar for this part. I'm leaving her for the rest of the video. I'm editing you falling into a pit of poo. <laughs> With my sunglasses. The sunglasses land on the pile of The sunglasses, poo they do nothing! <laughs> they make me feel better, damn it. I'm moving on to the next slide. Now it's your turn, Zeke. Uh, the secretary to the Liue, uh, Chishing. The blood Blue of both human and illum <laughs> illuminated. Wow, I can't. You spoke, and so my brain was immediately turning off. And so I was like, oh, illuminated. Illuminated. Uh, yeah, it illuminates the beast flows within their vianis. Graceful and quiet by nature. It's not the racist, gentle... they, they talk, talk like, like that. that! Come on! <laughs> yet the gentle disposition of the chillin sees not even the slightest conflict, even. With even the most arduous of work. Genshin loads. impacts, After I mean, all, not Chinese people. They firmly believe that all the work they do is in honor of their contract with Rex Lapis, seeking the well being of all living things within Liyue. Liyue? 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 Not a, so, a, a side note um, the English voice actors for Genshin Impact don't always say Liyue the same way. No, I'm sure they don't. Some say no, Lior for some reason. The the, the U, the U we. I mean, because they have shitty during, voice like, the directors. First, like the characters who like voiced their lines before the games. Which, I mean, it, it seems like they kind of got it down solid now. But uh, you, you heard lots of variations on the UA when the game first came out. All right, so uh, the answer is B. Is it now? It said graceful and quiet, so it has to be B. It said both human and illuminated beast, and that one has horns. See, A and C are smiling, and that's not graceful and quiet. It's true. They're not Damn, marriage material, good, good according to Asia. Man. Man. Man! I tried, didn't I? I tried. We, you guys listen, know I tried. If listen, you're watching this, you know I, I gave it my best shot, right? You only had... You don't think do... I phoned it in, dude. You, you think I'm a hack, right? So, like, okay, I'm trying to gather what the story of, like, Genshin, and even these individual characters are, and it feels like there are people that fight against the thing because they fight against the thing. So, it's, with the Liyue in particular, I mean, I guess, like, the, the easiest analogy for me with this Chinese god bullshit is, uh, like, the gods. So, like, there's the gods, of course. And then there's like the Adepti, who are kind of like demigods, basically. There's like tiers of this godliness or whatever. And the illuminated beasts, like Ganyu here, um, basically they're they're created by gods, uh, and they have to use all of their superhuman uh, god adjacent powers to basically do God's bidding for their immoral ass lifetimes, which seems kind of miserable. But I don't know. They they all seem pretty cheery. So they're angels? More or less, I guess. I'm gonna be real it's with not you, that Chief. Cool. I turned it's my brain off and cool, didn't man. even listen. Like, like uh, they're, they're angels, just... but not as cool. That's actually a good way to put it. They're angels, but they don't even get the fucking halo. They don't get the wings. They don't get the status. They're, they all they get is a five stars on the Gasha. That's all they get, apparently. They only have two eyes, no wheels in sight. No Wait, thrones. being being a creation of God means you have like tiny like four, five inch horns. That's all it means. Um, also, that you you have you're, you're one of the most busted characters in the game, and you can uh, outperform most team comps by yourself, um, just shooting arrows from a safe distance. Oh, so people have to roll for her. If they want yeah, to you you did. If you didn't, you're probably hurting. <laughs> you probably uh, wish you creep. did. She makes daily so much faster. I'm going next to the next slide. You did roll for Don, you man. You're hurting. <laughs> and then I said Pavonius. This character is the most trusted aide for the acting grandmaster of the Knights of Pavonius. You can always rely on count on them. You can just count on them to solve any intractable problems. Everyone in Mondstadt loves them. But no one knows what secrets this witty, charming knight has. Okay, so this is this is a trick question because none of them look witty or charming. I mean, 
you have to turn your brain off and think what do the developers think is witty and if, when I think when I think of dependable it has to be B because that's like I'm a dependable Nathan oh, ho, ho. but then you say witty and charming so the only like A and B aren't charming C like is implying to be charming but like Kodak moment fucking sucks so it can't be C no but it has to be C because look at the smile that means witty and charming well, that's not dependable. You can't depend on this guy. Oh, of course you can. So as soon as someone says a, a bad word, he's gonna start hey, sweating hey, hey. and Excuse run away. Me. Where is your evidence for said thing? It's because he has the fucking eye patch. Someone uh -huh. said fuck, and then he stabbed his eye out, and he's like, <laughs> uh -huh. "Do you don't you see the gold chain around his neck? He's totally a gangster." No, that's his slave collar. From his master. Oh, uh, right, I forgot. The master that he accidentally read the diary for and ran away from. Because oh, yeah, Deluxe! Yeah, remember? Deluxe is this guy's master. Kayak is a bitch. Gets ridden all the time. That's not how that. Alright. You know, th this part of the video is at least going to be for good content. Genshin fans are loving that, aren't you? Aren't you Genshin fans? Uh, I don't know if they love it when you ask them that. Although, on the Please other hand, maybe they like it when you watch, so I don't know. So I have, I have, is Kayak I have gonna finally C. get his moment? Because witty and charming, like, is. Well, it's a knight, so it has to be B. <laughs> I'm going with B. I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm trying. Like, see, like, I'm going with the strategy. Like, why am I thinking? <laughs> knight, armor, <clears throat> B. Okay, so B and C? Yeah. The stupid fucking boat. I told you. I told you, Lo, Lo, you turned your brain on. You told me that you didn't, but you did. You read too far into the description. You did not use your brain enough, dumbass. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, Kayak, you think, you're, you, think, you think you're charming and witty, Kayak? Alright, tell me a joke right now. Uh, yeah. Dude, I don't Knock, understand. knock, I, who's I'm there? Right Fuck that? you! read that in the wiki and it's like witty and charming I'm like is he? <laughs> this dude shows up a lot. I've never he's like a fucking weirdo. He and just that's flies why people all the like time him. and says like dumb he's just like silly shit that's not true. So he's wait, a wait, wait, wait. liar. He talks it's, it's weird like he's trying to be a smooth guy kind of way, but So is I'm, he just non murderous Majima? I guess. Well Majima's actually charming him. If it's He's, he's, he's funny. He's crazy. You, you love to, you love to see the goal of Majima doing his thing. Oh, it's man. true. I get what Kayak does. I don't fucking understand this character at all. All right, they're push a good the guy, boat but down they just the have to be a weird liar. Kodak moment. Time. Fucking he he downgraded my train. Now I'm back on this rickety ass shit. Fuck just, you, just, Kayak. Just, so Deluke and Kayak accident, have both kayak. shown up. Deluke and Kayak. Have both shown I've up. forgotten what both of their descriptions are already. Um, you made Woody lots and of jokes charming about them, and zealous and... passion, but also a cool. Why exterior. are their backstories so fucking boring? Like, like you, that you doesn't made, mean uh, anything. That could mean anything in any other game. What is distinct about this setting with your characters? Your characters are your most defining attribute of your entire story. It's what sticks with low. people the most. And if they have nothing low. to stick onto, then who fucking cares? Like, low. like who cares? Like, what is this theme? What is the theme? Uh, we're anime fighters. Oh, we have one character trait. Cool. Wow. Low. Do I have to remind you of the golden rule? You just use your brain. Why did you do that? Yeah. Why did you just attempt just to, like to rationalize normal -ass video a games. scam? You're not welcome in the Genshin Impact community, okay? Looks like your fucking $60 fucking complete experience. Emi Ashiro's entire backstory is a revelation on what it means to be a hero because of what we stereotypically assume is what is good and like just and noble is actually completely toxic and terrible and a d down path to horrid nature and it's like it's like what that's just like one dude that's just one dude all of them have equal levels of death of dramatic irony and says a lot about their myth and legend and tale and uh, oh, fuck. i'm a gliding champion get ready for the gliding champion of monstad <laughs> i'm so happy you went back to that because i was going to make that joke I was going to finish it with. Did you know but I won the championship? Why would you do that when you could be a gliding champion? 
Look out for the gliding cheap bots that those coming on through. Amber's design is super cute though, but I never use her and no one does because uh, she's the worst character in the game. You don't buff her. What's that? How about you buff her backstory? How about buff everyone? How about you buff her backstory? backside? Well, why do that? We can just release a new character. Make Shit. a lot of money. We told you, it's a it's money all the way down. Alright, we sent this ship floor. out to sea. What's next? Oh, right. I'm sorry. Before we move on, uh, since you made lots of, 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 of real, real nice jokes about uh, Duluth and Kayak uh, loving and kissing on each other and making faces, you should probably know that those two are half brothers. Dun, that dun, hasn't dun. stopped Supernatural fans. That makes it better, They're dumbass. They're half brothers, and they get shipped all the time by the Yaoi priest. I told you. That, that's a thing. That's a thing. And and, and so like, you think Kay Kayak is a bottom, huh? That's interesting. That's interesting. Take note. Lord Yowie grant fans, me the strength in note. my super shotgun. When you're saying take note, that means you're telling me to look this up. Get the no, I'm telling the, the, the I'm telling the Yowie fans in our in, the, in our audience here uh, that you just took a stance. Yeah, they know I, where you stand now. I oh, stand. Well, the, the other the other funny uh, one last funny. I stand by this it. motherfucker. Hmm? You stand by it. Yeah, fucking kayak uh, so sucks. So he's actually his nickname his nickname is Kayak among the player base uh, because the only time anyone wants to use him is when you want to use his ice powers to freeze water. Holy so fuck! I'm a god. Water. This game sucks. Yeah. That that thing, those those ice things throwing around him, that's his bolt. And if you pop it, uh, then you just get surrounded by ice all the time. You can run on water. How how would how would how how would is like the low. glorified surf HM the fucking top? That doesn't make any sense. Low, low. I just can I just remind you again for the 18th time that you got his nickname correct because you just spat out the first dumbass thing that came to your mind. Mm. Yeah. Turn off your brain. Reset Turn windows. Just listen to the <laughs> and activate, just activate embrace ultra it. piss stink. Just return to monkey, alright? Create a virtual machine inside your mind that is running a fucking lower spec system. And then hey, use that to finish the rest of this quiz. Don't, don't make fun of Xion like that, just because she opens up multiple operating system tabs in her brain. Okay, so just basically from now on, just assume that, like, if an AI generated an anime character, like, this is basically what that I That is a get. good way to put it, actually. There's also, like, what literally, one? like, I think I showed it to you, Doomkun, of, like, an AI actually just merging a bunch of generic anime characters and, like, creating yeah, generated ones. Yeah, it's like, oh, ones. yeah, there, there's traces of, there's an idea there. There's honestly the vibes I'm getting from this. It's like, I don't know what Genshin Impact's, like, cohesive, I don't know. There's nothing that really stands out, is what I'm saying. Like, if you earnest, if you honestly mixed in a Grand Blue in here, I would not be able to tell. I, I hate Grand Blue Fantasy now. Well, I don't play it anymore. I, I learned to hate it playing it. I fucking wish Genshin be I fucking, I fucking, I would fucking kill another human being to get Genshin, uh, Genshin Impact that had Grand Blue's character design. You would kill a dissenting member that is praising Hong Kong for some reason, a dissenting voice against the CCP, for yeah. <laughs> more interesting <laughs> designs. Take over Hong Kong. Just not destroy Hong Kong for you, China. If you give me the anime pussy I'm looking for, you can have anything you want. Now you're talking like it's Hollywood. Capitalism. No, no, no. Hollywood gets a little bit younger than that. Just ask Epstein. I'm going to the next slide. Uh, Zeke, I don't feel like reading anymore because I'm depressed because you guys keep getting too much of it right. Why can't I read? Honor of the J. Well, fine! Sh shut up, Zeke! Or, you, you want to be such a fucking big man? You're such a fucking tough guy? You want to fucking read the passage? You go ahead, bro. Go ahead and dip it, man. If you think you can, if you think you got it in you, then go for it. Let's see what you're made of. Owner of the Jadic Chamber in the skies above Leori. There are stories about abound about this character with their elegance and mysterious smile. As a Tan Quan of the Liwi Kikchingo, uh, not only do they embody law and order, they also represent duck sauce. Correct. Uh, you you did mispronounce a word earlier. Uh, it's it's it is as a Tiananmen Square of the Liwi Qixing. Oh, wait, 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 no, no, no. It, it, it's as a, as a uh, Taiwanese 
uh, owner of the Jade Chamber. Oh, yes, I forgot. Yes, the the Jade Chamber is actually in Taiwan. You know, um... Which is also known as Real China. Yeah, one I don't of know these what's going on with that on fake screen right now, One of these characters on screen has a little, like, bear friend uh, that follows them around. And Are uh, you sure it's a bear? It looks kind of like Pooh Bear. It's kind of like a Winnie the Pooh, doesn't it? It's kind of uh, like is a it a tanuki? <laughs> Wait, it's, 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 no, it's 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 just a it's a cute little cute little poo bear. Huh. Hmm. Anyway, I'm going with B. Uh, okay. I'm Mingguang. Mingguang. How about you, Fort? Uh, elegant and mysterious smile. Which one of these screams elegant? Well, I'm going with the, I'm going with C because there's Kui Sing and Sing Ku, so I'm assuming that's just the same thing. So I have B and C? Yeah. You notice I've, uh... Damn! Damn! Four, come on! Damn! This boy is sleeping! He's about to lose his feet. See, Zeke was right, but I just didn't care. I was like, that's C. That's a letter. See, that's the thing. Doom doesn't seem to understand that you've already given up. Zeke. Uh, yeah? Zeke, do you want to read the passage? Yeah, you gotta story? end it. You, you wanna... gotta end it all. You gotta end everyone here. No survivors. You gotta fucking send us up on a high note. Everyone's so high right now. You gotta make him keep him high. As the acting grandmaster of the knights, this character has always been devoted to their duties and maintaining peace in Mondstadt. They had taken precautions long before the onset of the Storm Terror's assault and they will guard Mondstadt with their life. All the way. It's Jean. It's just Jean. This is so generic. So I guess it has to be, see? <laughs> Man, shut up! Man! Man! Why is your personality... Your personality is just serious. That's all that said. Okay. Hey, fuck it, you know, What's the deal with this shit? I, I will end it on the happy note. I will say... Despite the fact that I forgot every single character's design except for maybe Amber's uh, and maybe oh Ningguang, at least on sight, their visual appearance conveys the generic emotion they want you to feel. Stern. Do you have anything to say for yourself, for it before I close this thing out? Like, as I, I think I've straight up deleted every single character except. Uh, Amber I can and feel them leaving my brain, my brain right now. Like, oh god, I forgot Kayak even existed. What I will say is that I think people came into this saying, hey, you know what? I love Genshin Impact. I, I play it every day. I really want, you know, to brighten up my day. And, like, you know, it's because you know, I play Genshin Impact because my life, you know, it's not great. And I want to see these this new fresh blood appreciate this game that I love so much. And to that person I say, Tiananmen Square 1984. Taiwan is a real country. Fuck Genshin Impact. Communist fuck my bandits. artifacts. Fuck my weapons. Fuck my character ascension materials. Fuck the domains. Fuck the, the weekly bosses. Get them! Fuck the, 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 the character ascension get bosses. Fuck the update frequency. Oh fuck shit! Fuck Poyo. Fuck on Damn, Impact Damn, let him down! Fucked okay, up having okay. bunny girls. I hate this game. I hate the player base. I hate one who plays it but doesn't consider themselves part of the community. I hate the community. And I hate you. Goodbye. Fuck you. Have a nice day. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. But seriously, stop playing this fucking game. Yeah, that, that's not a joke. We'll find you. Or, or at least, I mean, <laughs> we'll find you. I mean, you can enjoy things. <laughs> we can enjoy this things. This entire time, is recording everything you do. No event going we'll find on. you. Look, look. When there's no event going on, just, 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 just go outside. Just go outside. Just, just, just go outside for me and and touch just, some grass. Enjoy the Inazuma update. Um, I would like to thank both of you for joining me on this recording. Your 500 Chinese yuan is in the mail. Wait, is that the international kind or the national kind? Um. Wait, what's our I social credit? I forgot what our social credit scores were. Oh, uh, they're, 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 they're sky high now, baby. You can, you can trust me on that. I don't trust you. The agents haven't left my room. Um, I, I have. I need to. I need to go. Yeah, Wait, man. You my, are... my, my work here Can't is done. Can't I have food? My work here is done. Oh.
Uh -huh. why, why, are you, why are you putting us on a bus, though? Is this where we get our social credit scores higher? No, 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 we finally get to take a train. I don't know why they say showers on them. Why are the windows boarded up? Yeah, God bless the CCP. God bless fake China. <laughs> Can I stop recording now? Okay, goodbye. Yeah, let's stop. <laughs> the gliding champion of mine.